Hey, man, I'm gonna outwork everybody this month. Hey, man, I'm outworking everybody this month. You hear me? <laughs> this is it. And so I would say like two things that people need to start doing is that number one, just whatever you say you're gonna do. Let's go. Let's go, Andy. All right, Andy. Andy. Hey, <laughs> don't, don't, don't spill his Hold coffee, Evan. Don't spill his coffee. Don't, don't sip his damn coffee, God. Evan. We're here coffee for a sales for tip, closers, and you're over here still in yeah. the dude's coffee, I wanted the King dude. Closer's coffee, bro. Shit, man. Now God, Evan's always embarrassing. All right, Andy. Listen, man, thanks for having us down here at this beach house with you and Brad. We want to ask you, what's a couple of pieces of information that you could share to the audience that would change their life right now? So, yeah. you know, tell us what you got. And, like, on, like, compressing time frames, what you guys have been, what you've been able to do in our lives, in your own life, in, in the world life you're so good at taking what you find out and just implementing it and building this badass life how does somebody out there build this badass life and be able to ultimately take their family on five-star vacations and stuff like this and how do they do it the fastest what do you think well there's there's two things that I would tell everybody if I was gonna give you two pieces of advice that would mm -hmm. just change your whole life mm -hmm. um, number one is you got to believe in yourself yep number one I mean but people hear that and they're like oh yeah okay what's the next one go back to number one yep you got to believe in yourself. I mean, at the end of the day, a lot of people, they just really don't believe in themselves internally to their core. If anything's ever going to happen in your life, it's because you truly believed it was going to happen. And that's why it happened. Because nothing happens on accident. Nobody gets lucky. Luck, luck's for losers. You know what I mean? Luck lasts for a minute. We know a lot of people that made money for a couple years that are ass broke right now. Yep. Okay. And so if you want to make money for decades, you got to believe in yourself. And I think a lot of people just really don't believe in themselves. And I think that everything that we do in this world, I mean, think about sales for a minute, right? No matter what product you're going to sell, we're, we're salespeople. This is a sales channel, yep. right? And we love salespeople, right? Sales is king. Salespeople are king, yep. right? Um, we love salespeople. So a lot of people, they know a product and they're trying to sell it. Well, screw the product for a minute, right? Yep. The question is, does the client believe that you believe? right that what you're selling you believe in it mm -hmm. and so everything comes down to a belief mm -hmm. and if you win big it's because you believe big totally and if you Love don't that. win and if, if you don't Love win that. big it's because you don't believe big yep that's it so number one number one belief is belief yep and no matter how small you think that and is number two go back to number one well it's it's yeah. well it's the biggest thing in my life 100 percent. okay and then number two yep is going to be just do what you say you're going to do just do it listen hey hey man i'm going to go get a six pack okay cool Mm -hmm. Just do it. Go do it. And then people, they don't do it. Mm -hmm. People say, man, I'm going to be number one this month on the board. Yep. Okay, good. I love that. Go do it. Mm -hmm. Listen, I'm, I'm so sick of people telling me they're going to do something and they don't do it. They just don't do it. Everybody says they're going to do something. Every day we hear someone starting a new challenge, starting a new job, saying, oh, man, when I get this opportunity, I'm going to kill this. Okay, cool. Do it. And see, we said we were gonna build this company and we were gonna do this thing and we did it. Mm -hmm. And that's the difference is that most people, they don't do what they say they're gonna do or they do it for a couple years right. and then they don't take care of it anymore and then they're not doing it anymore. So true, so true. And, and so like the two magic things, and, and by the way, like I'm not gonna, it's just a simplification, like we're yeah, simplifying totally, this. Totally, totally. Number one, believe in yourself more than anyone's ever believed in themselves in this world. Make sure that that's you. Look, no one knows what's inside of you but you. Yep. No one knows what's inside of you. If, if Evan, if I, if I like judge you off your past and who everybody else said you were, the deal is is that even if I had all the information, if I took my own thought of you, I, I don't know what's in you, only you do. Right. Mm -hmm. So I'm asking you, if you're watching this, what's inside of you? Yep. Hey, what's going on, y'all? I know you're getting a ton of value watching this video right now. But Andy Elliott wanted me to tell you, listen, I'm the number one wholesaling coach in the world. In October 25th and 26th, right around the corner, Andy Elliott and I are hosting in my brand new office in Scottsdale, Arizona, over 9,000 square feet. We're gonna show you exactly how to build a seven-figure wholesale operation in 12 months or less. Listen, Andy endorses the fact that we know what we're doing. So what we wanna do is bring you here to Scottsdale, show you how to find the leads, talk to the leads, and get the big, fat, juicy spreads that I know you all wanna get paid. We're talking 20, 30, 40, $50,000 deals. So what I want you to do is text the number below and Andy Elliott and I will be waiting for you October 25th and 26th here in Scottsdale, Arizona. Let's finally get paid what you're worth. And now back to the video. 
Well, whatever's inside of you is whatever's going to happen. So that inside of you better have a lot of belief because there's going to be a lot of hardships. Let there's going to be a lot of rejection. There's Let me ask a, you this. A lot of negative I, people. I, I you, have, you have like a crazy level of conviction and a crazy level of belief. And every year I've been around you, it, it, it even, it, it continues to pick up. But when you first started out, like I could see in some of your videos that you didn't necessarily have the, the belief that you have now, obviously. Right. But how did you gain that belief? Like, how do you start? How did, maybe that's on video, maybe that's on sales. Like, what do you, how, what would you say is the biggest thing that would, would put belief into people? Okay, so let's say, let's say we were gonna, well, let's say we, were, we said we're gonna be the hardest worker in the company. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, all right, cool. So we're gonna do that for a month. Yeah. And by the way, we're gonna believe and then we're gonna just do it. We're, what does do it mean? We're gonna work like we're the hardest worker in the company for an entire month, and we're going to do it. Yep. We're not gonna go around the store telling everybody we're gonna do it. Hey man, I'm gonna outwork everybody this month. Hey man, I'm not working everybody this month. You hear me? <laughs> this is it. Okay, you know what? Go do it. Yeah. If you do do it. And you follow it, your, and you live and up to you your And you do word. what you say you're gonna do, I'm gonna tell you how this builds. After a month, you have evidence in you that you yes. know that yes. you are capable of working harder. Yes. And that evidence makes you say, you know what? I'm a badass. Yep. I'm gonna go do it again. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then somehow the next month, it, it gets, it gets, you work a little bit harder and it gets a little more believable that, you know, that that's really who you are. That's the way you work now. Yep. And then, and so like us, you know, we're on our fourth year in this journey. Um, every day, every hour, every month, you know, doing it, everything that we said we were gonna do, <laughs> yeah. it has given us, it has given us evidence yep. that we, we are doing it yeah. and that we can do it. And then when we do do it and we stop running our mouth and we do it, then, we get better. Yep. And Love so that. like, and so like, I think that's how, if you're starting there right now and you're like, well, I know, but where do I start? Okay. What do you want? Okay. What do you want to look like? How do you want, how do you want to view the world? How do you want people to view you? Okay. What do you want to win at? Okay. Now go do it. Go do it. I mean, we didn't know the play in the beginning, but we knew that we had to work hard. Yep. So the work hard parts, what we did. And then we learned that skill over the phone, right? Like believing in yourself was super important. We learned that our intentions were important. We had to care about people more than we cared about money. In the beginning, we're like, we got to make money. And then when we cared about money, we didn't make any. Yeah. And then we started caring about people. We made a lot of money. Right. It's just, it's just so you got to change your intentions. You got to change your belief. You got to just do it and keep your word when no one else yep. is doing. And then next thing you know, man, you're like, this rare anomaly, this like people think that you're special, you're gifted, you got lucky. How did that guy make it? Well, dude, everybody's out there running their mouth right now. How many times do we see people, you know, we're, we're big, you know, into fitness, right? We're not fitness trainers, but like, you know, we take care of ourselves because we're, we're men, right? And that's what men do, right? Yeah. And, and, but people say, <laughs> see people say, man, next time you see me, wait. Yeah. How many times you heard that? Yeah, thousands. Billions, thousands. wait, next time you yeah. see me, Andy, let's take this picture because the next time you see me, yeah. and the next time I see him, they're, worse. They're like, what you don't understand. Yeah. I, I had this, I had that, I had this. Dude, I had all those same things happen. Yep. Super important, guys, if you're watching this video right now and you're like, Andy, I'm not built like that. Bullshit. Yes, you are. Okay, you gotta train. That's the way it works. Train or complain, it's your choice. Okay, every day I train the greatest in the world. You know what I mean? Are you ready to kick some ass and build your legacy and make history? If you are, in the description box below on this YouTube video, there's gonna be a little link. You click on it, enter your phone number, email, full name, and I will personally reach out to you in the next 24 hours. If you're serious about kicking some ass, going to the new level, recreating, next version of yourself, I'm your guy. Let's kill it. Okay, I did all those things, but I still got the six pack. Still did okay. it. Okay, and why? Because I did it. And so I would say like two things that people need to start doing is that number one, just whatever you say you're gonna do, just do it, right? And if you tell someone you're gonna do something, I love that. But make sure that you do do it, okay? And if you do that, I promise you, man, you're gonna look up one day, five, 10, 15 years down the road, and you're gonna have everything you want, and everybody's gonna want to, you to coach them or to, to lead them to the next level. Your family's gonna look up to you. You changed your bloodline, you broke your bloodline, you broke generational curses, you looked in the mirror, you're proud of you, you're surrounded by good people, yep. and you're doing stuff that everybody's like, how'd you do it? Yep. And you're like, well, 
I had to believe in myself because yeah. the minute you quit believing in yourself, look, dude, the world ain't going to believe in you all the time. Nope. And even the people that love you as much as they say they're going to believe in you forever, they may, they may one day not believe in you anymore. So the one thing that you damn sure can't ever do is stop believing in yourself. Oh, believe. Dude, um, love Andy, that, dude. You, last, last question. Who do you believe is the better twin? Who's your favorite twin? Dude, dude that's a great question. Come on, Andy. Tell them. Tell them. Tell them, Andy. Don't you hold back. Dude. Tell them, Andy. And don't you tell them. Tell them, Andy. Don't you tell them. Don't you touch him. Tell them. So the truth you already drank his damn coffee, and now you're messing with him, dude. Tell him, Andy. Well, the truth is is that I'm not really sure which one's which. That's a good answer. So I think that I I just I say, hey, like my son last night, he was, I, I said, Ian, sit next to Evan or Ian. Just sit next to the twins. Yeah. And so that gives it an option to, yeah. to sit next to either one of them. Yeah. So I'd say my favorite of the twins. <laughs> That's good, man. Hey, this video is fire. If you literally watch this video 70 times, the, the thing with most people is they hear something one time and they don't just like internalize it and make it part of their core. What he's saying, he actually truly lives by. What he's saying is our identity. It's our beliefs and that evidence part. Finding that evidence, it will create that different identity. And if you can keep doing that, then you're going to wake up one day and be so thankful that you did or you're going to be miserable that you didn't. Yes, and Andy always says, the re you know, repetition is the mother of all skill. So just doing it, keeping your word, it's going to build that internal self-esteem and build that conviction. So when you're around people, they can tell in your eyes if you truly believe what you're saying. They can tell if you're there because you just want some money or if you're there because you believe in what, you be what you're selling, your product, your company. You know, find those core values, find those core beliefs inside of yourself and draw a hard line in the sand. You know, stop negotiating with yourself and figure out a way to become the person. Draw it on a piece of paper. Figure out exactly who you want to become, you know, and, and just start keeping your word on exactly who that's going to be, what that person looks like, what that person talks like, how they act with their friends, how don't they act with their the family, contracts. and don't fucking negotiate. Don't and if you can do that and go. you can believe, you're going to kick ass, man. And by the way, we got your back. So like, subscribe, and share this freaking post with somebody who needs it. Pool. And let's go, baby. Love you guys. I would have been the worst twin. Let's for that. go.